It's the Channel 4 Morning Show. 90 minutes of music, fun, and information. Before we get to you, let's uh, say good morning to this fabulous audience yeah, that we have here this morning. Look at this gang yeah. from Columbia High School. Yeah. Wow, what a terrific group. Whoa. Man. Yes, yes. All from Columbia High School, is it correct? Yeah. This is obviously the band. Either that or they, they dress the math classes different down there. <laughs> <laughs> this is our math class, math class uniform. Yes, they do. They and what look I, so colorful. They, they look are. colorful, but look at those big smiles. They look like they're actually here to have a great time. And if they're ready for it, I think we are, too. We'll march right along. Yes, right? march right along. Oh, I like that. That's kind of cute. Thank you. <laughs> well, we're at 10 minutes before 6 now here on the show. we got this terrific audience here. We have folks from Columbia High School. We have folks from Lakeview Elementary. We have, uh, I don't know where you folks are from. Nashville. From Nashville. <laughs> We've got Marie Lester's husband right here. This is Mark Mosley. Mark, good to have you here this morning. Let's hear it for, for Mark. And Mark, up until just seconds ago, your own wife was sitting right there. She didn't want to be seen. No, the minute she knew the camera was coming on, she says, I, I need to move. I need to move. I can't be seen next to this guy. Yeah. And also, it's Maud and Dorothy, everybody. Yes. Oh, champions to be sure. And with, with, have, you, have you seen Bill Dundee wrestle before, Maud? No. Oh, well, you better watch out. He might cut loose at any minute. <laughs> He might get you in a half Nelson or something. Is that, I, guess, I guess that would be Ozzy, right? I, I, way too subtle for this hour, huh? Let's get some NBC Sports. Right here on the Thursday Channel 4 Morning Show. We're having yeah. a good time, aren't we? Yes, we always yeah. having fun yes, right sir. here. I'm telling you, this is a place to be. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we have a was, group. That was Johnny Cash. Oh, what? Yeah. 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 It was Mr. Magoo. Yeah, Mr. Magoo. <laughs> Uh, Mr. <laughs> Mr. Potato Head yes. is celebrating his 40th birthday tomorrow. Do you know that? Yes. 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 Oh. Yeah. Do, you, do you all know what Mr. Potato Head is? Yeah. Oh. You right. got what? He's mad. He's all excited. This Wait a minute. What? What'd you say? I said, that's my husband, Mr. Potato Head. <laughs> oh, no. I think that. That's some of that English humor, I guess, isn't she it? She calls him Spud. Spud. <laughs> yes. <laughs> All right. Well, we, before we get to Kenny's song here, we want to wish Linda Sanders a happy birthday today. She's on her way out here about a quarter after the hour. All right. So we want to wish her a big happy birthday. All of her friends at American General yeah. say happy birthday to you, Linda. We wish you the best. Faithful watchers of the show. And also want to say a happy 37th anniversary to uh, Snooky and Louis Hayes. Their anniversary is on April 29th. want to wish them the very best. Snooky, they call her. Yeah. Isn't that a neat... Uh, Snooky, she oh, says. Snooky. 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 I could listen to you Snooky. talk all day, Marie. That's great. Yeah. Y'all ready to they're do gonna, some... Uh, they're going to do all they're, kinds they're, of things, but I don't know prime. what they're going to do back here. The Columbia High School Band yeah. and Teddy Starr. Yeah. Woo! Oh, yeah. All right. You know I can't be found. I sit no more alone. You can't come around. And easily tell the phone Don't be cruel The heart is true yeah. Baby, if I made you mad For something about it said Please let's forget the past The future looks right ahead Don't be cruel The heart is true Well, I don't want no other love oh, Baby, it's just you want I know you know don't stop thinking of me Don't make me feel in the way Come on over here and love me You know that I want you to stay Don't be cruel Do a hard truth Why should we be apart I really love you baby Cross my heart up to the preacher and say I do well then you know you have and I know that I'll have you I don't be cruel 
still hearts true Well, I don't want nobody love Well, you, it's just you I'm thinking of I don't be cruel Still hearts true I don't be cruel Still hearts true Well, I don't want nobody love Well, you, it's just you I'm thinking of Kenny Starr. Oh, you mustn't. You Aren't mustn't. they something? You mustn't quit. Kenny Starr oh, and the Columbia no, High School Band. They were band. great, and I thank y'all very much. Great oh, boppers. Yeah. They are good boppers. Yeah, yeah. yeah. How long have you been bopping? Uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> 120 seconds? Yes, man. They had the rhythm down. They had really? the words down. The they moves? had the... Well, the movement was a little wobbly. Well, yeah. Yeah, I'm not too sure. But it was, Kenny, it was right, fun, wasn't it? Excuse yeah, me, I had the mic just a second. Excuse me, these people, the folks from Lakeview Elementary, were enjoying the tune too. Aren't we good? Yes, you are. <laughs> <laughs> they were, they were Thank into you. the groove too. Oh, uh, you, you. Oh, excuse me, you wanted to get in there and and dance and sing Why too. Why are you talking to me? They, <laughs> because you look like the one who would be embarrassed the easiest. <laughs> oh, we're glad you're all involved. It's, uh, that was a happening yeah, tune, Kenny. Yeah. Thank you very Thank you, much. We appreciate it. Well, you know, we're lined up now for the Stupid Tricks Contest. All right. We're going to yeah. move right up here, and, and let's introduce our stupid, st stupid, <laughs> our stupid trick guy for this day. Step right on up here, please, in your name. Ray Hall. Let's hear it for Ray Hall, everybody. <laughs> Ray, that's quite a reception. I can it appreciate it. Sounds to me like they've seen your act before. I don't think so. Really? No. Well, we've got uh, we've got a surprise coming up from you, and you are yet another contestant in this long-running contest where you're going to do some uh, some trick that well, will be fascinating, uh, interesting, hilarious. Probably uh, really stupid. Really stupid, really stupid. at least. Um, well, you had a guy last week who actually did this, and it's the only other person I've ever seen do it really? on your show. And we've had two right here. You'll be the second one. I'll be the second one. This is amazing. So I'll just offer my apologies beforehand and, <laughs> and right. make the best of it as I can. All right, and we'll see it in just a second. Let me tell the folks that the entry blanks are available at all of our uh, Channel 4 morning show um, uh, sponsors. You can pick this up, or of course you can create your own and get it into us. We'll give you all that mailing in info a little bit later. Right now, though, you need 15 of those. We've got 20 different contestants including uh, our contestant for this day and you write them all down and send them in and you may be one of uh, six pairs of trips to Cancun, Mexico. Does that sound good? Sounds really nice. Of course, you're not in the running for that. You're in the running for trick tickets to the David Letterman Show and a thousand smackaroos. What I can think? deal with that. You like that? Yeah, I, can, uh -huh. I can handle that. Yeah, that money part got to you quick, didn't it? <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, Ray, what are you going to do for us? Well, I'm going to do what I call the throw to phone and it, I know it sounds silly, but uh, I'm going to do the throat of phone and mix in a couple little things on the side and make it interesting. All right. Well, ladies and gentlemen, let's give him a round of applause. Get to it, Ray. Let's hear it. Thank you. Uh, you familiar with the Adams Family? Yes. Okay. Theme song to the Adams Family. All, All right. right. I know you're exhausted, but step back up. <laughs> That'll wear you out, won't it? I just wanted to duck out of sight. <laughs> yes, I, I understand. After a, after a run like that, it could happen. But we've got to get your score, okay, from the band. And let's go up there now. Here are your scores, right? Seven, eight, seven, a nine, a seven, and an eight. There you go. That is a total score of 46. Congratulations. Let's hear it for him, everybody. Thanks, Ray. Appreciate it. Good to have you here. Good Thank you. Here. All right. Well, folks, if you want to get in on the running, it's not too late. You can audition for uh, the rest of the Super Tricks uh, openings that we have uh, that run through just about the end of May. And all you got to do is give Guy a call. Call the Hot Tricks Hotline. Super Tricks Hotline. 353-2350. That's the Stupid Tricks Hotline. 353-2350. And I think hosting this show is one of the uh, tricks, isn't it? Yeah. So 
get get on the phone and give guy a call. And also, we want to thank the folks at Instaprints uh, for the uh, for the applications. Thank you very much, and check them out. They are in uh, five different locations in town. At 16 after six o'clock right now, news is up in just a moment. But first, let's get off to the word from DT McCall. Folks, we've had a good time here this morning with all the gang from Columbia High School. The band is here, and right now they look way too serious. Uh, <laughs> they they got up real early this morning to come on in because they got some big doings. And so let's find out who's here. You are Bradley Roberts. Bradley Roberts, and you are. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, and you are Patrick. Fowler. Patrick, I may have I may have to get up here to talk with you. How tall are you? Almost 6'6". Six, 6'6". Six. Six, six. What grade are you in? 12th. 12th grade. And you are growing fast, aren't you? Yeah. What What instrument do you play? Trombone. Trombone. Oh, all right, man. That's kind one. of player here. You got it. Uh, let's uh, find out what the event is. All right. We're having a band day, which includes a donut sale, and we're having a yard sale, and there's uh, over 40 vendors that are contributing. Wow. And there are still spots available. There's $7 a spot. You mm -hmm. show up and you get one. When's the big event? Uh, Saturday morning, um, this coming Saturday. This coming Saturday morning, what time will you start? Uh, uh, eight. Now you are, is that, just, is that just like off the cuff, you know? You, right. Yeah, yeah, no, well, let's have it nine. We sell donuts earlier in the Do morning you? and then we come back for the yard sale. All right, well that sounds like a lot of fun. Is the band going to be playing? Uh, no. Okay. Because we'll be working at, at the yard sale and the car wash. Car wash, when is right. that? It's going on the same time as Oh, okay. So you got lots of things happening right. then. What's the location for all this? It's at Columbia Central High School. Uh-huh. Well, that sounds good. You all ready to go to work this Saturday? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Come on, let's get to it. That's a handsome outfit you got on there. Why is your uh, outfit a little different from everybody else's? Um, I'm one of the field commanders for the band that uh -huh. directs the marching band. All right. Well, that's very nice. That's very sharp. And your, your outfits are a little different, too. Why is that? Um, I'm in the guard. All right. And you in the guard? Yes. All right. Well, America is stronger because of the guard, and we want to thank you <laughs> very much for it. And, and this is, uh, you're the... Uh, I'm just, horn line, I'm just there. Just, just, I'm just there. No, isn't that sweet? What, what instrument do you play? A clarinet. Clarinet. It doesn't matter on the field, though, because nobody can hear the clarinet. <laughs> that, that's not true. Oh. That, yeah. Yes, uh, you're a trumpet player. Yeah, well, thanks to you, we can't hear the clarinets. And we, we can, no. Well, fellas and ladies, we sure do appreciate it. Thanks for coming in this morning. I know you had a big time. And why don't you go ahead and have a seat, because I wanted to mention... Is there more? Yes. Oh, no, oh big surprise. You ready? One, two, three. Get well, Mr. Brown, we miss you. That's your band director. Isn't it? Now explain to us who Mr. Brown is. Mr. Brown's one of the band directors at the school, and he had surgery recently, and we're hoping it will speed your recovery. All right. Well, we add our wishes to that. You must think an awful lot of him. All right. Well, congratulations to him. He should be very proud of all of you. Thanks for coming in this Thank morning. You. We appreciate it. You know, one other thing. Go ahead and have a seat. We wanted to uh, point out today that today is Mr. or tomorrow will be Mr. Potato Head's 40th birthday. And, you know, I mentioned Ozzie Nelson a little earlier in the show, and it got a little ripple. Uh, we mentioned a couple other names. It got a ripple. But when we said Mr. Potato Head, this guy went spastic on us. <laughs> what is your name? Mark David. Mark, are you, are you a Mr. Potato Head fan? Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, really? Now, how long has that been going on? A few years now. Yeah? <laughs> Guy's wild about Mr. Potato Head. Apparently, loads of people are. When he started on TV as a toy back in 1952, he's just really been a big deal ever since. He is Mr. Potato Head is like a guru showing us the light, according to some guy in California, which probably sounds about right, doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. Have, have oh my God. If <laughs> this. For those, oh, oh my God! For those of you, for those of you who are, for those of you who are in the bathroom brushing your teeth, you need to come out and look at this. Get out of the bathroom, ladies and gentlemen, Mr. Potato Head. This is your life. Thank you. Somehow it don't seem right, does it? No, no. 
Brad, can you make his head uh, pull from left to no, right? Is that what? I think it already is. It's all, it already. <laughs> <laughs> well, we appreciate you going along with okay. the bit there. Yeah. And uh, can we show him up close, though, just to see what he looks like normally? At, no. no. Now there. Now there. That's a good look. It's a handsome look. And yeah. Yeah. And we're there. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> oh. oh, God, I hope nobody's watching this. <laughs> <laughs> it, somehow it had Martian qualities, didn't it? Yeah. yeah. Well, uh, that's about as much fun as we should have at your expense today. And you've taken it real well. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good one, up, I promise. It's a good one. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Get off me. Well, well, well. Uh, <laughs> this. <laughs> uh, anybody else want to get into the act here before it's too late? Come on, let's show Pat down here. Let's see how he see how he looks as the as the as the Martian. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You know, you have a striking resemblance to 60 star Mia Farah. Uh, I'm sorry? Yeah, looked like something out of an old Supremes movie, didn't it? Yeah. Well, we have had a big time. Keith, Kenny. You look like Conway Twitty. Yeah. yeah. There you go. Man, Hello, nice darling. Well, we've had a big time. Bill Dundee, come on in here. Let's, let's all scoot down just a bit. Bill, we appreciate you coming in this morning. It's been great to see you. I have went to bed lots of times at this time. I have never got up to go nowhere. <laughs> but I appreciate you having me in Thanks for coming in. Bill Dundee, thanks, everybody. Have a good day. Thank you.